some savory Parmesan and herb rolls. So in the bowl frothing here, I have a half cup of warm milk. I have a teaspoon of instant yeast and a teaspoon of sugar. I could tell that my yeast is alive because we're getting some froth on top. So to this, we're gonna add one egg yolk and now I wanna get my dry ingredients going. So I have two cups of all-purpose flour here, two tablespoons of sugar, quarter teaspoon of salt. So we mix this together. Now our dry ingredients are ready. Butter goes in. Okay, our wet ingredients are mixed. We're gonna add in about a third of our dry ingredients. All right, now this is starting to form a dough. We're gonna speed it up a little bit now because that flour is starting to get incorporated. All right, we take our dough out, put the ball in my bowl. I cover it with a towel, and we're just gonna put this in a warm, not hot place till it doubles in size. Look at it, Liv. We're gonna get six rolls out of this. We're gonna bake it in our cast iron pan. I need to melt two tablespoons of butter in the pan first. Now we need to make the filling for the dough. To my butter here, about a third of a stick, we're gonna grate a clove of garlic. I'm using a cup of aged Parmesan. Parsley goes in, so I have butter, Parmesan, parsley. Some scallions. All right, scallions are gonna go in, so it just mixes with the butter. It you, smells so good. Right? Yeah. So it's garlicky and buttery. I'm gonna put a little cracked black pepper in there too, because it's just how I'm feeling right now. I'm gonna start working it with my hands first to kind of establish a rectangle. All right, now we're gonna start rolling this dough out and we gotta get this to about 15 inches in length. Now we take our butter mixture and we're just gonna press this out about three quarters of the way to the edges on the top and bottom. And now we just roll this up into a log and we just pinch as we go. Now you could cut this with a chef knife, but the easiest way to do it is with some dental floss. Then I know I need three and three and you cross it and then you're just gonna pull it straight down and it's gonna cut right through and you're gonna get a smooth cut. Boom. <gasps> wow, that's nifty. It is. So now we're gonna take our pan that is coated with the butter. We're gonna take our rolls, go right around. These are gonna proof for about 30 more minutes. They're gonna expand. And then when we bake them, they're gonna expand again. And I'm gonna bake these at about 350. I have the coals on one side, no coals on the other. I'm gonna put the lid down. It's gonna take about probably 12 to 15 minutes. Love it. Those, wow. Savory. Look amazing. Parmesan Can herbs. I help you with those? They also smell <laughs> amazing. You don't, you don't trust me? <laughs> okay, ready? <laughs> oh boy. Commit to the flip. There we go. Okay. Mm. Look at those.